Hey guys, it's TechRan here. In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to set up a keyboard cam on your stream. That's actually just a simple overlay that you can easily set up. Now, you might be wondering how to do this because one, you don't want to use a keyboard cam. Or maybe you just want something that's a solution that's absolutely free. I'm going to teach you how to set up one here today. So, let's get right into it. The first thing you're going to need to do is go to this website here, which I will have a link down below, and download the zip file for Norboard. And once you get the zip file on download, you're going to click show on folder and extract the file. Once you've extracted the file, we can get studying it on up. Okay, now that our file is all extracted, all you want to do is click this Norboard file right here. When you see it load, it's going to be a little document file, nothing really much going on with it. So we're going to right click inside of it and then click load keyboard. When you're in load keyboard, you'll see right here, you get a few different options, but we want to click the Y7YT. And when you click that, we want to click clean and black. Clean and black will make it look like a nice little cam right here. You can see here. And then we're going to add this now to OBS. So let's load up OBS next. So you can see right here, we have nothing really going on with our OBS. Of course, we had a, a camera for our actual PC, which you can see here. And I load up Apex, it's going to have Apex. But what we want to do to add this actual keyboard cam is we want to go to add a window capture within window capture we want to just click OK and it should be the first thing that's defaulted to but if you don't see it's going to just say Norboard and you just look through your device and look for Norboard and with that we're good now you're going to see it's got some green to it if you want to remove the green all you have to do is right click on the property file click on filters add a filter and we're going to add a chroma key which is going to make it so that the green's going to remove the green color since it's keying it out and with that we're all good to go now that we added it into obs and we start recording you can see here that i folded obs and have gameplay full on screen but my viewers will still be able to see the keyboard cam like you see here so that way you can use it for streaming or just for recording your inputs and that is how you set up a keyboard cam with mouse inputs in obs if you guys did find this video helpful you know what to do make sure to smash the like button get subscribed so i miss out future tech content and of course you want to do me that favor get subscribed because we're trying to hit a thousand subscribers before the end of 2023 so hopefully that'll be the case but i got another video to recommend for you guys after watching this video which is a video on how to set up an easy keyboard cam 10 out of 10 can recommend or this video over here on actually how to set up a timer in obs for doing countdown for events or something special like that until then i'll see you guys for another video g man out